Hello there guys and welcome, it is Niran here and today it is time for me to bring you my first ever FIFA 16 career mode video. I've managed to get my hands on EA Access, therefore early access, for 10 hours on the game so I'm going to be bringing you daily uploads for the next week from that. I bet you guys weren't expecting that because I've been saying that I was going to do videos from when the game came out. But yes, yeah, surprise, here I am bringing you my top 10 wonder kids on FIFA 16 career mode. These are the best players on the game who are under the age of 21. It's solely based on potential as well. The highest player in this, I think in this video, having 90 potential uh, as well. Everyone in this video has 88 or above. If you're not subscribed already, make sure to do so. That would be massively appreciated as you'll be seeing a lot of FIFA 16 content in the coming months. And make sure to smash the like button if you do go on to enjoy. 70 likes on my first ever FIFA 16 career mode would be massively, massively appreciated. But nevertheless, in at number 10, the first player in this list is Julian Brandt of Bayer Leib. Leverkusen. The left mid was very good on FIFA 15 as well, but he's even better on FIFA 16. 74 stat at the start of the game with 88 potential. 81 dribbling being his highest attribute as well as good acceleration, sprint speed, agility, balance and reactions. Ball control, short passing and shot power are good as well. Can play on either wing as a left mid, a right mid or even as an attacking mid from Germany playing for Bayer Leverkusen in the Bundesliga with four star weak foot, four star skill moves. He's 19 years of age and he is an extremely good player. That was Julian Brandt in at number 10. Ten, number nine, we have got something, oh, it pains me to say, as a Liverpool fan, you may not know I'm a Liverpool fan, this one pains me a lot, and it's Raheem Sterling in at number nine, but going past that, he's obviously got incredible sprint speed there, 93, 90 agility and 91 balance, as well as good acceleration, dark green ball control and dribbling, as well as good crossing, finishing, and short passing as well, he plays for Manchester City now, in the Barclays Premier League, 82 overall, and has 88 potential, like Julian Brandt before him, again, can play on either wing, he's from England, can also play as a striker with high attacking work rate and three star skill moves, no, three star weak foot sorry, and four star skill moves at number 8 we've got Nicolas Sula the centre back from Hoffenheim in the Bundesliga, 78 stat when the game starts and 88 is his potential, 93 strength not entirely sure how that doesn't give him the strength speciality but I'll get onto that late at a later date, uh, he's got very good stand tackling and slide tackling as well as interceptions so a very very solid defender and 80 heading accuracy as well, making him a bit of a threat in the air from corners, 19 years of age, as I said with 88 potential from earlier on, he's German, can only play as a centre-back, so not too versatile, but I think that's that's the only place you'll need him, and uh, yeah, medium attacking and defensive work rate, Nicolas Sula at number 8, at number 7 though, we have got Paco Alcacer of Valencia, another player again with 88 potential, a fairly common theme throughout this video, he's 80 stat though when the game starts, and 84 finishing, very very solid, I suggest he'll probably become a poacher and a finisher in terms of his specialities when he's reached his potential with the attributes that he has in terms of good finishing and very good attack position as well good ball control balance and agility go along with that too 21 years of age from Spain can play as a striker or a centre forward high attacking work rate and four star weak foot and three star skill moves that's Paco Alcacer at number seven number six though we have got Luke Shaw the left back from Manchester United a player with fantastic potential on the game and in real life unfortunately in real life he suffered a pretty poor pretty horrendous injury actually. Um, but on this game he's got fantastic potential there very good sprint speed as well as agility um, and acceleration but very good defensive stats as well there 81 stand tackle and 80 slide tackling making him a very very all round left back very good in sort of supporting the wingers and going forward but also in his defensive duties too from England high attacking work rate with 2 star skill moves and 2 star weak foot playing for Manchester United as I said in the Barclays Premier League he's got 88 potential as well and starts the game at 77 at number 5 though we have got one of my favourite players in all history this is Briel Donald M. Bolo of Basel. This guy, I just flip in, love this guy. F FIFA 14, no, FIFA 15, sorry, career mode with West Ham. He came in for two seasons. He was absolutely awesome. And he's got 88 potential this year. 76 stat at the start of the game and only 18 years of age from Switzerland. He's committed to the Swiss national team. He can play as a striker or a right mid with four star weak foot, three star skill moves, medium attacking and defensive work rate, but also a fantastic physical page. 85 strength, amazing acceleration, agility, stat stamina and sprint speed as well as ball control too. Next up though at number four we have got Paolo Dybala of Juventus. I think he's just recently signed from Palermo, correct me if I'm wrong, so you might not be able to get this guy in the first transfer window, same as Raheem Sterling from earlier on, but he's 78 stat at the start of the game, fantastic agility, uh, sprint speed, balance, ball control, dribbling and finishing as well. Uh, he's got 88 potential, again like most of the players before him, medium attacking but low defensive
defensive work rate, 21 years of age from Argentina with four star skill moves and two star weak foot. He's got really good curve as well. He's looking like an absolutely incredible all-round striker as well for when he's reached his potential. Paolo Dybala then at number four. But moving on to the rostrum places, we've got Maximilian Meyer of Schalke, the attacking mid who's just been a career mode god since time began. Certainly on FIFA 14 anyway, and FIFA 15, and now onto FIFA 16 as well. The guy, the attacking mid with fantastic speed as well as balance and agility, 83 ball control and very good dribbling as well as short passing, long passing and curve. 19 years of age, can play as a centre attacking mid or centre mid, high attacking work rate with medium defensive work rate, four star weak foot and four star skill moves, playing for Schalke in the Bundesliga, certainly a bit of a replacement for Julian Draxler. At number two though, we've got another Manchester United player and it is that man, Memphis Depay. Look at that physical page. 91 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, amazing strength, agility, balance, stamina, reactions. It's just insane as well as good long shots Free kick accuracy of 90, shot power. This guy must be one of the most fun players to use on the entire game. 81 overall, playing for Manchester United in the Barclays Premier League. He's not got five-star skill moves anymore, but he does have four, which is pretty decent. 21 years of age from the Netherlands, with high attacking work rate and medium defensive work rate. Two-star weak foot as well, and he has got a potential of 89. But coming just behind the winner there, Memphis Depay, Yuri Tilo on though is today's number one with 90 potential, 76 stat at the start of the game. The Belgian playing for Anderlecht, still in the Belgian Pro League, so you can pick him up. Probably it probably be fairly expensive to be honest to have 90 uh, 90 potential. But look at his look at his stats, look at his attributes: 81 ball control and 85 shot power. Uh, they're the only ones I think in the dark green. But look at the amount of light green attributes he has. Absolutely insane all-round centre mid. He is going to be absolutely awesome to use when he's got to his potential on FIFA 16. Five-star weak foot as well as three-star skill moves can play as a centre mid or an attacking mid. 18 years of age with medium attacking and defensive work right there from Belgium. And he is right-footed. But of course with five-star weak foot it doesn't matter too much. You could probably ping one in from distance on his left foot as well. But nevertheless... That is pretty much the end of my first FIFA 16 video. Make sure to subscribe for more FIFA 16 content throughout the coming months as well as tips videos all this week and two episodes of Career Mode with Leicester City as well. So stay tuned for that. Like if you did enjoy the video. Press that massive thumbs up button or fairly small thumbs up button actually. If we could smash 70 likes as I said at the start of the video that would be absolutely awesome. Comment about enjoying the video if you enjoyed it that much as well as telling me your favourite players on FIFA 16 and also some ideas for the tips videos that you guys want to see as well because I always want to please you guys and show you the stuff that you want to see but nevertheless it has been an absolute pleasure ranting at you guys today have a good day enjoy yourselves and goodbye <laughs>